fight in Brooklyn again. I feel good. I feel good. We've had a, we've worked very hard in camp, and uh, we're just looking to put the work uh, to good use now on Saturday night. Um, you were down in Florida for camp, spar with your mom. How'd that go? It was good. We had great work with Imam, uh, Jordan Fermenta, another uh, prospect, uh, the Cuban defector, who had a lot of amateur fights, uh, and a couple of other guys who were uh, giving some really good work. Um, Bracero, you guys had a moment earlier. You guys know each other very well. What's this fight going to be like with him? Uh, bittersweet, you know. Uh, he's always a guy I've rooted for and to, ch to better his life, to change his life, and he's on the verge of it. Just he winds up on the verge of it against me, who's also trying to get the last little bit out of my career and uh, have some goals as well. So it's a good crossroads fight. Uh, I respect him regardless, and I respect him after the fight, but uh, I know the competitor he is, and because I know the competitor that he is, I've trained, I've trained very hard for him. All right, Paul, finally, what's motivating you to get back in the ring right now? Just uh, an opportunity to do some good things, uh, an opportunity to uh, still keep dreaming in that ring and uh, uh, to uh, try to accomplish some things that maybe people don't think I can, but uh, I feel like I still can. We'll see if I can put, put, myself, uh, put my skills to good use and uh, put myself in a position to accomplish those things afterwards. Thanks a lot, Paul, man.